the one thing I was most afraid to do initially is to ask a question because I thought I should know it. <laughs> and so people would come and present their work or they would, outside of the classroom, it would be like, um, you know, research scientists go and they go to different universities, they give lectures, they talk about their research. I was definitely afraid to ask them anything because I thought my question would be stupid, <laughs> dumb. <laughs> um, and that's the, it's the complete opposite, you know. It's, you're supposed to ask questions so that you learn. I mean, that's what we're here for. I love when I give a talk and people are asking me questions. The more questions I get, the happier I am because they obviously understood enough of the topic that I was discussing that they were interested and they wanted to know more. And so the questions are just, and the questions are really good um, in the sense from the other perspective is because I never know when someone will ask me a very naive question and it stumps me. Because we get so, so um, focused on our little research area that sometimes we just ignore some real basic um, ideas. And so questions are absolutely essential. And I initially was very afraid to ask a question. So I just started watching people and seeing what everybody else did. And then I heard someone ask a question, which I knew the answer of. And I go, I think that's a dumb question. But the, the, the uh, person who answered the question would say, oh, that's a great question. This is, you know, <laughs> what's happening. And so it's just an experience in, in, in watching other people. So that was, that was really something I had to learn to get over.